The Marathon Stage in the Skoda Titan Desert Morocco is always tough. All Titans sleep in a giant single haima and are not allowed to any kind of external assistance. A good physical recovery for the second leg of the Marathon Stage is the real challenge. Today, 119 kilometers in the desert, high temperatures, rocky terrain and soft sand sections awaited the Titans. Both overall leaders, Mantecon and Cortecas, had things clear. The best way to defend their first places was by attacking. The stage today took the Titans to one of the most beautiful places in Morocco, with the chance to see amazing landscapes all along the route. The leading group, with both overall leaders in it, stayed in a single peloton until a trio formed by Sylvain Chabanel, Guillermo Stein and Pau Martha launched an attack aiming at a possible stage win. Meanwhile, the group of the Red Jersey, Mantecon, Loza, Sanchez, Herrero and others took different tactical decisions. The breakaway was finished at kilometer 84, but at this very moment, Luis Leon Sanchez decided to go for the stage win and set a frenzy pace that nobody else could follow. In just 25 kilometers, Sanchez opened a 7-minute gap with the rest of the field. At the finish line, Fran Herrero was second and Sergio Mantegón had no choice but give him up the red jersey. Luis Leon Sanchez is the new overall leader in the men's class. In the women's, Tessa Cortecas and Pilar Fernández rode the first 45 kilometers together, but from that point on, the stage lead was the Dutch rider's property. In the same way Luis de Sánchez did, Tessa showed why she is the strongest in the field. After setting a furious pace, she crossed the finish line super happy and almost in tears. Well, I still cannot believe uh, how how I felt today. Looking forward to tomorrow's uh, stage with the dunes and navigation. The marathon stage has offered a thrilling episode of the best mountain biking. Titans have been put to the test, but they all have shown why they can be considered a special breeder. Tomorrow, the penultimate stage of the race, a 100-kilometer loop stage where the dunes in the RCV will be decisive.